Hello, I'm Illuminate McCauley. Here's your channel's television morning news update for February the 18th, 2020. The Emir of Kanu, Mohamedou Senussi II, the President of the Senate, Ahmed Lawan, and state governors have been talking tough on the state of insecurity in the country. The need to restructure and decentralize the country's security system are some of the suggestions brought to the fore at an event marking the 60th birthday of the Kaduna State Governor, Nasser El Rufai. The leaders agreed that the prevailing security challenges confronting the nation cannot be handled by the federal government alone, but require the constitutional role and support of the federating units. Meanwhile, a police inspector has been killed by gunmen suspected to be cattle rustlers in Niger State, while two other officers were injured. The incident occurred as the gunmen were said to have attacked Muchi Akachi village in Mariga local government area of the state with the aim of rustling cows. The police, however, said they are on the trail of the bandits. The acting chairman of the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, Mr. Ibrahim Magu, is pleading for the United Kingdom to extradite former Minister of Petroleum Resources, Tizani Alison Madweke, to answer charges of alleged money laundering. Mr. Magu alleges that Mrs. Alison Madweke and her collaborators stole not less than $2.5 billion from government coffers when she was minister. On the international scene, the United Nations says at least 22 people have been killed in an attack on Ntumbo village in northwest Cameroon. No one has claimed responsibility for the incident in which over half those killed were children with several victims burned alive. And in sports, Manchester United beat Chelsea by two goals to nil in a one-sided English Premier League contest at Stamford Bridge. Anthony Martial got the opener of the 45th minute of the first half, while Harry Maguire made it two, heading home Bruno Fernandes' corner in the second half to hand the Red Devils their 10th win of the season in 26 games. And that's the news update. Don't forget to join us later for the evening recap. I'm Olumide McCauley. Thank you for watching.